Hey, what's going on, Dawkin fam? Welcome back to the channel. If you've been enjoying the videos, be sure to smash that like and subscribe button. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to raise the super attack of Terrestrial Flash Android 16 from 1 to 15 without using any Elder Kai's. Now, just in case you don't know, this is the Android 16 that you get from the strike event that comes every single week. Guys, if you're free to play, these are cards that you should be working on until you max them out and then potentially open all their hidden potential. Their super attack maxes out at 15 and then if you read the description of the event, it makes it very clear that if you get the super attack to 15, they have a significant boost to the amount of damage that they can do. So it's definitely worth it. However, there's a process that you have to go through in order to boost that super attack because when the card is not TUR'd, you can only get the super attack 10. So you're gonna need quite a bit of medals, quite a bit of zenny, a bunch of trading items, but it can be done. So, this is what the card looks like. Uh, leader skill, not too bad. Int type HP attack and defense plus 30%. Uh, causes huge damage to enemy for the special attack. But if you take a look at his passive skill, Damage received minus 55% when God is activated. So if you're running an extreme intelligence team and you're taking a lot of damage in some of these events, if his guard activates, he can significantly, significantly cut down the amount of damage that you're taking. So definitely worth having on your team, especially if you're trying to do the LR Goku or LR Frieza events that come every single weekend. So let's go to his event really quick. So you'll find the Android 16's event, Gentle Destroyer, under the story category. And then once you get in there, guys, what I want you to do is, as fast as you can, clear stage one so that you can keep repeating uh, Z-Hard for seven stamina. Now, every single time you clear Z-Hard, you're going to get at least one drop unit of Android 16. And if you're lucky, you'll get two at a time. What's really great about these strike events, guys, is that you're always guaranteed a drop every single time that you do it. So if you're free to play and your level is low, obviously your stamina is limited. So at least you know if you're grinding out these events, it's definitely worth your time. So what you're going to have to do here, guys, is grind that event out about 10 times and then combine all those units together to raise the super attack of Android 16 to 10. Then you're gonna have to do it again five more times and grind that card out and then raise that Android 16 super attack to five. And then what we're gonna have to do is TUR both of those units and then combine them to have a super attack of 15. So like I said, it takes a little work, but you're always guaranteed drops, so it's really not that bad. And then obviously you're gonna need special Android 16 medals and you get them from stage two. And stage two is only 12 stamina as well. And it's gonna take seven medals in order to TUR him per card. So you're gonna need seven for the, for the one that's at super attack 10. You're gonna need another seven for the one that's at, at super attack five. And then obviously once you finish that unit, you're gonna have to get four more androids and then TUR them so you can open up all four hidden paths for this unit. So what we're gonna do now is we're going to go to Awaken because I have actually done some collecting as, uh, already, as you guys have probably already guessed. So you saw that I already have my um, Android 16 at Super Attack 10, so he's ready to go. I've already grinded out another one, so this is what he looks like in his base form. Great Power Unleashed Android 16. You can see that his super attack is at five, and then I have one extra dupe here. I'm gonna need three more. So in order to awaken this unit, first of all, you gotta raise his level from one to max. So the SR Android 16, if you click on him once you max out his level, so once you click on Awaken, you're gonna see that in order to get him from SR to SSR, it's gonna cost 20 Bubbles Medals, 10 Master Shens, five Kamis, and then one West Kai. And it's gonna cost a total of 560,000 Zenny. So then what you're going to do is click Z Awaken to get him to the SSR level. And then once this unit is SSR, that's when you're gonna have to start pouring in some medals that you might not have a lot of. So as you can see right away, we got the medals from his event. So there's seven there. You're gonna need seven more West Kais, seven more Kami medals, and then now you have Turtle and you have Bulma. So these right here. 
we got Bulma, and we got Turtle. Now you might see these metals in the Baba shop from time to time, but the best place to grind these metals is the World Tournament. Whenever you guys are doing the World Tournament, if you see a purple capsule with gold tips, get as many of those as possible because nine times out of ten they're gonna be turtle and they're going to be Bulma and you're gonna need a lot of those if you plan on awakening all your strike units so let's go ahead and do that and as you can see it costs cost quite a bit of Zenny. it costs two million and three hundred and twenty four thousand just to awaken him so let's awaken him really quick And there he is, we have our Android 16 at Super Attack 5. He has now been TUR'd. Uh, and then what I'm gonna do really quick is just click on him again. We're not gonna awaken him because I already have one awakened, but obviously you're gonna have to max out his level if you don't. So if you have no UR Android 16s, you're gonna have to max out his level. And then when you go to awaken him, you're gonna need some more medals. So you're gonna need 50 Dr. Jiro, 20 Master Shens, 10 Kamis, 3 West Kais, and then 1 Elder Kai. And it's going to cost you 1,875,000 Zen in order to do that. Now luckily you only have to do this awakening once. Because once that one's maxed out at Super Attack 10, you're going to go to training. You're going to click on the one that's maxed out at Super Attack 10. And then you're just going to combine that one with the one you just TUR that's at Super Attack 5. Then as you guys can see in the top of the screen, it's a plus five for the super attack. So let's go ahead and begin. And just like that, you now have a TUR unit with a super attack of 15. And like I said, if you're free to play, you probably don't have a lot of units where the super attack is maxed out, or not only maxed out, but where you actually get a significant boost to their super attack just from maxing it out. And then obviously guys, once you complete this process, then you have to start working on four more of these androids where you only have to TUR them the first time. You don't have to get them from SSR to UR. You can TUR them, keep them at the SSR level, and then you can go into hidden potential and you can start opening hidden, hidden paths and really start awakening these units to maximize their damage output. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more of these videos on the other units that, are, that come from strike events, let me know down in that comment section below. And I hope you guys are on that grind and you're all doing well. And if you're free to play and you have some stones, I'm going to send you some spirit bomb luck right now. So go pick a banner, do a single summon, and then let us know what you get. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See you guys.